हे गाइस आई एम निशांत एंड वेलकम टू साइबर नाइटिको सो इन दिस वीडियो लेट्स टॉक अबाउट दिस टॉपिक दैट सेज रिएक्ट जस्ट गॉट इवन मोर ऑसम सो इट मींस दैट वी हैव अ न्यू अपडेट इन रिएक्ट दैट्स इनकमिंग एंड दिस विल इंट्रोड्यूस अस टू द यूज्ड होम सो आई रीड दिस ब्लॉग पोस्ट ऑन डेट डॉट टी ओब दैट सेज ऑल दिस थिंग्स यू कैन रीड दिस आल्सो आई विल लेव द लिंक इन द डिस्क्रिप्शन of this video so what does it says how it will work so it says that we are finally getting a native way to handle async function in react we don't need to rely on the use effect so that is said here to fetch our data which we can simply create an xus fetch and wrap it in a use hook like this so basically this is a api call in this side where we are using the use effect hook so it says that we don't need the use effect hook now we can simply use this what is this use hook to get async api calls we just need to wrap this fetch post first let's see we have axios get request which is fetching the posts from here which is a async call fine and its result is getting stored inside the fetch post variable or const fetch post then we are wrapping the fetch post in use and this result of this operation is being stored inside the post variable then we are simply using post title and the body like this we are mapping so that's what it says we don't need to use use effect now for api calls and how does it work this is the hook it says similarly to await it simply unwraps the value of promise meaning that any async function or behavior can be unwrapped in a used hook and react will natively handle the promise for us so that's what it says and other stuff fine so it's a i think good good what good change in react that will make us our that will make the code to write easily i think you know what i mean that's how it will work but this update will be in somewhere near the future it's not out now because if we try to use it this will not work we don't have any use hook currently in the react app it will be released later so you can see this thing also this R F C S, which introduces this support for async await in server components. That's another thing, and the use of this. You can read this. Take the example of await in server components and use a client component and hooks. And that's all for now. Like the video, subscribe to channel, this channel, and share also for more videos or tutorials like this one. tutorial means on javascript or react okay